One of the first areas that I'd like to cover is setup and extension. And what Microsoft has done is they've brought all the setups to a single place. So now there's a new setup and extension page that provides a centralized place to be able to do all of your setup. So no more hunting and pecking and finding where a specific setup lives. You just go directly to the setup area. There's a setup assistant wizard there, if you will. And that wizard sets you through some common setups to streamline the process for you. Rather than giving you an entire page of empty fields, the wizard steps you through it and gives it to you in bite-sized chunks. And for each bite-sized chunk, there is a description of what the impact of that setup is. So it makes setting up various areas of nav a lot more streamlined and a lot cleaner. Now, of course, for your diehards out there, we still have the manual setup process. And it's under the same area as all the other setups, but it has its own branch off of the menu. And here is where you can go and really do the setups traditional ways that you guys have been doing them all along where you go into each respective section, you set up each field within each of the setup pages and really configure the system the way that suits your business the best. One new feature here that we touched upon a little bit earlier under the setup area is the service connections and add-in area. Now this area is relatively new. It's been there, it's just been in bits and pieces all over the place and what Microsoft finally did was they brought it all together under one menu item to give you a more streamlined approach to doing these setups. The service and connection area allows you to set things up like OCR or connection to your mail servers or connection to CRM or any of the other external services. These are those external services we talked about earlier. And then as well, the ability to identify and see all the extensions that are listed within your database. And this is a first time where you're actually able to see all of the extensions that are written for you by your partners directly within the application in a, in a single view. You will also be able to see any extensions that are installed through AppSource or Microsoft App Store for the D365 Arena. So if you do any of that, you will be able to see them here in the services connection and add-ins area. So with that said, here's a quick screenshot of what that looks like. And you'll see here, what I did was I really focused on the manual setup area. And what you'll find is when you go to the manual setup area, the menu really breaks it out into functional area of the software. So there's the general setup, and that's things like your company name, what countries you do business with, what currencies you accept, and languages, and that kind of thing. Very high level or broad setup, if you will. Whereas then you have your finance specific setups under the finance menu, your sales and purchasing and jobs, and so on and so forth. So now it takes a lot of the mystification out of what do I specifically need to set up to stand the new module up on its feet within that, or enhance the module that we're currently running, what is driving the specific settings that cause that module to behave a certain way. So this way, it breaks it all up for you and really makes it very user-friendly, if you will. 